when you can't move, it will paralyze you. You're talking, looking at somebody that ought to be ashamed. I ought to be ashamed of myself for some of the stuff I've done in my life. I think if I take my clothes off, all of us can get naked. I ought to be ashamed of some of the stuff I've done in my life. But only by the grace of God and understanding Romans 8 that says there is now no condemnation. That's the only reason I can hold my head up high now because of all this low down dirty things I've done in my life. Don't you be ashamed, ashamed and embarrassed for what you've done. I don't care what you've done. God will forgive you. He will wipe your stay clean. He will forgive you. I don't care who does remember. God will look at you and say, I don't remember. I love you. I have washed you. I have cleansed you. I'm not condemning you. Don't let nobody else condemn you. If you got shame, come on right down here. Run down here right now. If you got shame in your life, if you're embarrassed about something you've done, you had an abortion, you've done somebody wrong, you've done the unthinkable, run down here. Come on, somebody. You're not the only one. I'm going to shame the devil tonight. The devil trying to put you on an island and make you think you're the only one. Let me tell you something. In a crowd like this, there's always 20 people dealing with the same issue. Every time we come together, therefore, every time you come in here, don't think you're by yourself. Here comes one more, two more, three more. Come on. Who else? Come on. No, no, you're not going to walk around in shame. You're going to understand you're a blood bought redeemed child of the living God. Come on. And he loves you just like you are. He loves you just like you are. Are y'all ready to pray? Come on. Say, dear God, I confess right now that I'm a sinner. But I believe that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. And I also believe that Jesus died for all my sins, all my sins. And I believe that God the Father raised Jesus out of the grave that I might be saved. Now today, according to God's word, and what I believe in my heart, and what I'm confessing out of my mouth, I am saved. Thank you, Jesus. I am saved. Somebody say, Satan. Say it like you mean. Say, Satan. I renounce you tonight. I'm through with you. I turn my back on you. It's a brand new day. My tomorrow has finally come. What the devil meant for evil, God has turned it around for my good. Now tonight, in 2013, I am saved. Come on, brother Hope. Amen. 